Hello and welcome to my video today. So I'm just doing a second part here on this Mesh-tastic Heltec um, LoRa32. So I found this web flasher that works with um, Chrome. I already flashed, so I got flashed both um, devices here. I got here and the other one. Now they're just they're working, running on power from the, from the laptop. Pretty fancy with a very swift, fancy Swift with the case. Fancy Taylor Swift with the 3D printed case. So Heltec V3 picked. And their documentation is pretty good. Um, yeah. Uh, and then I just picked the latest stay, uh, stable beta version. And then Flash. And I had, I used like fl flashing with an online Arduino cloud service or something. And I had to install some sort of something but this one this one just worked let's see here uh, update sure and yeah I got here com3 port you are <coughs> already flashed them so I'll do it but um yeah just the driver is automatically connected from for my system anyway sometimes I've had problems with it before but they're already set up with the ESP32 UART uh, bridge controller com5 com3 um, and then it just flashed. And it was pretty, pretty simple to be honest. And then, then it worked, it said, um, check meshtastic.org to set your region with the web client or the app. So I tried to get this Python CLI, but I got like a uh, meshtastic installed but whatever I just like okay I'll just try the the um application on my phone I have an iPhone so I just use web and yeah it worked pretty good to be honest just downloaded from the app store and it oh allow Bluetooth allow um location and then it found it um so I'll do that try to do like screen record of the phone oh yeah it's pretty good pretty pretty um pretty good and I guess like so far, I have one of the f devices connected to my phone for Bluetooth, and the other one is connected through the LoRa. But I also use MQTT, which is nice, as automatically connected. So I don't know if it's too far and switches to LoRa maybe. Um, and the math doesn't work because maybe I need three minimum. I'm thinking because like, it says node map, but I can like send messages. From my phone, like hello, where are you? I, that's where are you? Like if you're, well, you know, sends it here, and then you can see it on the screen here. Oh, I'll show it later. Is it better? And um, yeah, so that's pretty nice. So I guess if I had like my phone connected to this device, and my buddy, he has another device connected to his phone, we can message back and forth when we don't have internet and um, any service. So. Uh, and then also, I assume the, when the map works too, if you have your phone, you can see the, the nodes on the map, and yeah, it's pretty nice. And likely other use cases, like you said, um, for monitoring systems or anything. But you could use this and the infrastructure that's already set up. Say, so, okay, connected to uh, a sensor, hardware, monitoring, send it to, and it's already on your phone. Read it, it has like logs, also battery management and consumption. So I think it's pretty nice. Um, yeah. Pretty nice uh, project. Mm, yeah, and yeah, I guess it's good. It's good for using this, like I said, this infrastructure and preset uh, open, um, open source software for also any IOT monitoring systems. Pretty cool. Anyways, yeah. Check it out, check it out.
So I printed here the case. Oh, it's. I just took this one. Yeah, so I left it for a couple hours here. Yeah, turn off. Got the Bamboo Labs A1. Just found this on Thingiverse. Picked the best one that I thought looked good. I got two, because might as well. I already have two, um, um, what are they called? Heltec 32, Heltec Laura 32. Let's see here. Got this, let's see. Yes. For the cable, for the antenna, inside. Yeah, not bad. Pretty good, pretty good print quality. As per use from the old Lam Bamboo Lab A1. It's pretty nice um, plug and play. Just send it. Don't have to clear it, don't have to level it, don't have to just send it over Wi Fi, bingo bango, printed and quick. So, yeah, let's see here. Okay, so, okay, so. Let's try one at a time here. This is what I meant, it has this battery cable already set up. It comes with it. You just plug it in here and hook it up to a battery. I don't have a battery yet, but I can order them, likely. And this has room for the battery, so. So one here, one here, one here. Let's try it. It's a good look at the instructions, but I feel like let's just see how it goes. <laughs> uh, this looks like there's a. It could it could be useful for tightening it to that. Way makes the most sense. Put it in here. Like that. It's pretty tight. Tolerance. Let's see that. Well, it fits pretty good. It's for the um, this V V three, so so pretty cool, pretty cool. This. I think I could attach the base of it like this with the nut, with the bolt and nut here. It could be work. Could work. Good, how was this order? Oops. Not sure what this was for. Button top something. Let's grab the next one. Okay. So 
let's see the order of the okay just for just for reference Oops. cat yeah so I feel like this could be a good what a cat good order to have it locked in there and then attach the antenna to that what a mia come with let's do a quick hand tight hand tight for now and yeah we'll have five inches Anyway. Okay. Just gotta tighten these on much wrenches here, I don't think. But well, that looked pretty good. Let's get loose. Use case proof concept. And this, I guess, goes here. Yeah, what are you doing? Okay, this is a cat. Okay, this is a key. So, squeeze this. Okay, nice. This, I don't know what this is for. This maybe. It's pretty good, I see, man. Nice. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Please stop. Yeah, it looks pretty good, I see. Wow. Don't know what. Oh, it's for the buttons, I guess, in here. I don't know, I didn't really know what this was, I just printed it with the... Just poop it in there, I guess. Mm. Mm -hmm. Looks good, I guess. I guess I need to, though. But, I don't know. Just for fun, just figuring it out. Figuring it out. Yeah, looks good. Just need the battery and... Couple more of these, whatever they are. And yeah, it looks good. And we'll flash it and try to get more of the software and the firmware going. But I feel like the hardware. It's nice. These um, this kit. 